What's up guys? This is Tech Kavindra here bringing you latest tech news and product reviews. Here what we discuss today. Do you guys want to know the truth about internet modems? Just wait up. How many of you are renting their internet modem? Okay, so I bought my router. Uh, the brand is Aris. Is that how you pronounce it? Whatever. So A R R I S Aris, I believe. So, anyways, this is a SBG sixty four hundred modem. I bought ah, about a year ago. Uh, here's the router and the Wi-Fi. Um, so here's where you connect the coax cable and this is the power and this is where you connect your um, network cable all right here the secret you guys ready for this mm-hmm alrighty so why I bought the modem I could have rented this from Time Warner Cable. By the time I bought the internet connection, it was Time Warner Cable. Now they're uh, Spectrum, right? Anyways, again, it saves you money. Let me tell you why. So this modem I bought it for, I believe, was ninety dollars. So if you rent that from Spectrum or Verizon or AT&T or whosoever your internet provider is they charge you a rental fee guess what if you rent the modem you have to pay taxes also my personal recommendation is buy the modem outside I mean go to AT&T or whatever you provide us uh, you know website and look for you know what type of um, modems they recommend because this doesn't work for AT&T and Verizon every modem does not work for every provider so they have different modems that work for you know different services so in that case go to the website and find out and buy the same modem from Best Buy or from Amazon I bought this from Amazon I have the link for this modem uh, below so check it out if you're um, you know a spectrum I mean time Warner cable before so this modem works perfectly I never had any problem Our only drawback is the reset button this is a Wi-Fi indicator so sometimes if this is like green that means not okay if it's like yellowish you know if it blends yellow that means your internet connection is pretty good I mean Wi-Fi connection is pretty good so if it's kind of like green sometimes it slows down or it doesn't work at all so what I do I try to reset but it does not reset in this modern I don't know why uh, that's the only thing that pisses me off <laughs> anyways I love this modern so far so good uh, what I do I just disconnect from the power don't disconnect from here if you're connecting this to an extension switch that off so this will turn off and turn on again and it will reset so uh, here's the thing if you buy the modem be careful again let me tell you this if you are moving constantly you know you don't stay in one place more than a year or two it's not a good idea to buy a modem because the internet providers dominate some areas for example before I lived in a condo so the entire condominium properties have to go with Verizon because the property owner has a contract with Verizon I don't know if it's legal so you don't have a choice you have to go with Verizon if it's expensive or whatever no choice the same way some areas in Southern California Time Warner Cable is the only provider so maybe AT&T is the only provider so if you are moving you know every time so rent a modem that's the best thing to do 
if you don't really move out so much, you know, buy your own modem. So, a lot of internet providers charge you seven to fifteen dollars rental fee on your modem. So that's a lot of money for a year. So if you stay for a year, you can buy a modern to yourself that's forever and you don't have to pay any rental fee plus tax i hope you guys got some good information today so i like this product anyways so aris good job on this one when i bought this one it had good ratings so that's why i bought this from amazon so i mean so far i don't have any problem the only thing try to keep it cool i mean especially in summer so i keep it my modern kind of like hidden right next to my computer sometimes it heats up so that's not good for the modem sometimes so have it uh, where you get fresh air you know good amount of air like somewhere like here you know for example somewhere right here hope you guys got some good information today so if you like the video don't forget to give thumbs up and comment if you have any questions shoot me an email on info at techcowinder.com go to my website check it out if you want to contact go to contact page you can find me there too and don't forget to subscribe all right i'll see you next time